Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at the types of cloud computing. We have three here for us. So we have software as a service, platform as a service, and infrastructure as a service. And you can see that we have this nice pyramid here. I promise you it's not a, sch a scheme. It's just a, a way of showing how one is built on top of another, okay? So starting at the top here, we have uh, uh, software as a service, also known as SaaS. Uh, and these are for customers, okay? So the idea is that you have a completed product that uh, that is run and managed by the service provider. So you don't have to worry about how the service is maintained. It just works and remains available. So we had some examples of uh, um, uh, SaaSes here. Maybe you'd have your Gmail or your Office uh, 365 or your Salesforce, okay? Uh, going down to platform as a service, this is really intended for developers. Uh, and it removes the need for your organization to manage the underlying infrastructure and focus on the deployment and management of your applications. So the idea here is you don't have to worry about um, provisioning, configuring, and understanding the hardware OS. It just works. So you have an app, you push it. So for AWS, you have Elastic Beanstalk. Um, uh, then there's also Heroku, which is a very popular service. And then I believe there's one called like Engines for Google. Um, and then the last one on our list here is infrastructure as service. And this is really intended for admins. Uh, and so uh, when you're using AWS, uh, GCP or Azure, this is what uh, uh, infrastructure as a service is. So it's the basic building blocks for cloud IT. So it provides access to networking features, computers and data storage space. So you don't worry about the IT staff, the data centers or the hardware, but you have access to all those resources to build whatever you want, okay? And so obviously a uh, if you wanted to build your your own uh, platform as a service, you'd build that on, on top of an infrastructure service. And if you wanted to build your own software as a service, you could build that on top of a platform as a service or an infrastructure as a service. So there you go.